What is up everyone? Welcome back with the smiling faces. I hope you all are enjoying my videos and today uh, that part, that part. Guys, I was in today I'm at Juhu for some work. I can't just do that right now, I'll tell you all tell you all this about that in the later part of the vlog. But I'm very really excited to talk about IGTV. 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 Instagram TV. Now, part of being a creator, not just a YouTuber, being a creator is to create content for multiple platforms. I happen to make videos, so I put them on YouTube. That's the best place to go, but obviously I'm on Instagram, I'm on Twitter, I'm on Facebook. I put my content all over there. Now, that's for creative reasons, but also you don't put all your eggs in one basket. That's not a smart thing to do. Because you don't earn your audience at one place, so you diversify. And the sky is saying it's going to rain, and I need to reach Ville Pale, so let's get there first. Oh, shit! It's raining heavy today. Whew. Now, about the IGTV. Now, but before that, I'm a huge, huge YouTube fan because YouTube is the best platform for video creators. Like, they have like, no one has been able to. YouTube has everything that a creator needs. It has this amazing creative community. It has massive audience. It has. They have it all. They have all the tools. They have all the videos. They have all the stats. They have all the eyeballs. They have all the monetization. They have every feature you could want as a YouTube watcher and as a YouTube creator, all in one place. So if you want to grow yourself as a creator and get eyeballs on your work, you go to YouTube. If you want to look for a video online, you go to youtube.com. It's just that simple. The best search engine, it has the main part. It has monetization, like creators can create and make money out of it. They can earn from their videos. That's the best part of, uh, about YouTube. And YouTube has never had this direct competition till now. Like there have been other apps that they have tried to uh, build up like YouTube. Like Periscope for example, Snapchat. Uh, there, as a creative person, there have been plenty of, plenty of creative people on Snapchat. Vine, Vine, we basically saw the whole life cycle of a YouTube competitor through Vine. There's Vimeo, they, they've kind of just been around for a while, sort of in the background, but there are like 10,000 times less eyeballs on Vimeo than YouTube. So if you're picking where to upload your video, if you want it to get seen or you want it to get feedback on it, people are gonna pick YouTube every time. And after YouTube, Instagram is the second trending uh, social media platform that I can say where creators and everyone else is going, sharing their pictures, sharing their stories, trying to engage the audience. And now Instagram has IGTV, which is a direct competition to YouTube because Till now, Instagram was supporting a minute long, in minute length of videos, and now IGTV it has IGTV which supports lengthier videos. Like I have uploaded a seven minute long video on that. That's that's mind blowing. That's like a big deal, big big deal for everyone, not just me, every other creators. That's really exciting about that. Now I don't know if they're looking ahead to monetize something or like that, but this is going to change everything for YouTube. Now, me, I'm a YouTube fan, like I said before, I love YouTube because whatever I have learned about filmmaking, about vlogging, and whatever I'm doing these days, I've learned it from YouTube. So I really love YouTube, but lately YouTube has been catching a lot of heat with its monetization thing. Like a lot of creators have been complaining that they have met all the requirements to monetize their channels, but that's not been happening for six months. For some people, it has not been happening for an year. And that's really demotivating all the creators. And Instagram already has a huge audience base plus it is partnered with Facebook and now it's supporting lender videos it's it's a game changer all all it needs now is to find a way for a solution to monetize the the whole thing so that people are more excited to create and upload on IGTV and a lot of people are already doing that so it's going to be it's really going to be a game changer now I need to move out of this I'm right now in Ville Parle I was in Juhu, I came here for some work, like I said before, I can't, still, I still can't uh, disclose that. Now I need to go back when it's raining so much, there has been a water, water, you know, you see, a lot of water on the streets. I don't know how to get out of my car right now, because I'm having shoes, this is going to be a big deal. Let's figure this out. 
Auto is a big problem in Mumbai. Yeah, auto. Oh yeah. I don't know about this. Finding an auto is a big, big thing, but now we are sorted. Sorted. Oh well, we made it home. Didn't drown anywhere. It's safe and sound. Got a little wet though, but that's totally okay now. I'm editing my videos, and while doing that, I realized one more thing. That's the YouTube videos that I make. They are 16 by 9, and the IGTV videos that I have to work on will be. 16 yeah, nine by sixteen. Yeah, that's that's for the mobile experience, vertical videos, and that totally makes sense because Facebook had made this attempt before that was called Facebook Blueprints. Yes, and I don't think that worked out, but this thing, this thing's really exciting and I'm really pumped to do this. And that concludes our video about YouTube versus IGTV. Now, you guys tell me what do you think about the IGTV thing? Are you pumped? Are you excited? And are you planning to put your content on IGTV? I'm going. I'm totally gonna do that. So that's it for today. Now hit the like button if you like this video. Check out my other videos and let me know what you think about them in the comment section below. Subscribe to my channel if you already haven't, and my hand is spinning. Ow! I will see you guys in the next video. Adios.